Hey guys, here today, welcome to another video. Today guys, we're gonna be talking about something pretty cool in the GP world. We're gonna be talking about the new GTX 1080 and the new GTX 1070 that were released yesterday. Now, these are kings. These are amazing video cards. I'm super excited for both of them to come out. Yeah, it's just really exciting. They were just announced yesterday and they're gonna be using the new Pascal architecture. Now, Nvidia has been really praising these as the most powerful video cards to date. They're saying that the new GTX 1080 will have more power than two GTX 980s in SLR. That's, that is amazing, honestly. That is, that is so much power. And coming in at only $599 for the standard edition and then $699 for the Founders Edition. The Founders Edition having slightly more better overclocking, you know, it's being overclocked out of the box, all that kind of stuff. But... Yeah, they're a little bit more expensive than getting, a, say, a 980 when it originally came out. But at the same time, these are performing so much better. These are amazing. And think about it, you're getting the same performance for half the cost. Well, actually, a little bit more of the performance for half the cost. That's amazing, honestly. Two 980s in SLR is the same as a single GTX 1080. That's, that's pretty goddamn crazy. Now, the GTX 1080 will be launched on May 27th, and similar to when the GTX 970 was released, I kind of imagine that they're going to be sold out within the hour. You know, you got you to gotta be on that website to get that. You know, you got you to gotta prepare and stuff. But, uh, yeah, so it's coming out May 27th. That's, that's only 20 days away. 20 days away. Now, I don't actually plan on getting a GTX 1080. I don't got $600 to just plop down on a video card right now. But, that's where most people come in with getting a GTX 1070. Now, the 1070 is going to be coming in at $379 for the MSRP model. And then $449 for the Founders Edition. Which is... Yeah, that's pretty great, honestly. It's going to be released on June 10th, which is probably going to be a fucking problem for me because I'm pretty sure that's a Monday or a Tuesday or something. And I've got school that day. It's the day before the last day of school. So, yeah, hopefully hopefully I can manage to get one because I really want to put some money down on one of these because they're saying that this GTX 1070 is going to be more powerful than a Titan X. What? A Titan X? For, what would that be, like one-third of the price? With a Titan X coming in at about $1,500 right now? That is crazy, honestly. That's just, that's mind-blowing. And how they were to do this is because they are using the 16 nanometer process nodes. Now, this is very important because it uses less power and they can fit a shit ton more on there. It's using almost double the amount of process nodes. Uh, yeah, so I think it's coming in at 16.3 process nodes compared to only 8 on the 9 series, the 900 series. So, yeah, that's that's amazing. I'm really excited for the new Pascal units. So, if you guys want to see me do any videos on the 1070, then any encouragement down below to see me get one of those. And compare it to my MSI 970, you know, we can do some comparison, some videos on that kind of stuff. So, yeah, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. If you're excited for the new 10 series as I am, then make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you want to get some more videos on anything technology based see you guys in the next video bye